Carl Sagan, The Demon Haunted World, Science as a Candle in the Dark. In The Demon Haunted World, Science as a Candle in the Dark, Carl Sagan explores the importance of skepticism and scientific inquiry in the pursuit of truth. In a world where pseudoscience and superstition often overshadow rigorous investigation, Sagan emphasizes the need for critical thinking, challenging conventional wisdom, and embracing curiosity to propel human knowledge forward. This book summary provides a comprehensive look at the process of scientific inquiry, the struggle against scientific illiteracy, and the power of scientific thinking in shaping democracy, innovation, and our understanding of the universe. Discerning the truth through skepticism. To understand the universe, we must challenge our assumptions and test all assumptions through rigorous skepticism. The scientific method requires critical questioning, careful observation, and repeated experimentation to distinguish the most probable explanation. This constant skepticism helps scientists correct errors, find better explanations and ensures a deeper understanding of the universe. Science Illiteracy Epidemic A vast majority of people in America lack scientific literacy, leading to widespread belief in pseudoscience and superstitions. Due to emotions overcoming rationality, astrology and other forms of pseudoscience are more popular than hard scientific facts. This lack of interest in science poses a serious threat to individual enlightenment and the moral fabric of our society. Alien Abductions Debunked Despite thousands reporting alien abductions annually, there has never been any evidence supporting these claims. Hallucinations could explain these experiences, caused by things like sensory deprivation, high fever, and a lack of sleep, to name a few. Furthermore, crop circles, often thought to be definitive proof of extraterrestrial visits, have been proven to have a human origin. Misconceptions about scientists and science Many TV shows and movies propagate negative stereotypes about science and scientists, popularizing the idea of the mad scientist and portraying science as an undesirable field. However, scientists approach all ideas with skepticism and are open to all possibilities. Public distrust of science is not baseless, as science can be morally ambiguous, and findings can be used for evil instead of good. For this reason, scientists must uphold high ethical standards and share their findings openly to address the public's fear of misuse. The Role of Science in Modern Life Science helps us avoid danger, improve our material conditions, and grapple with life's big questions. Even with ethical concerns, the benefits of scientific innovations weigh more than potential hazards. Science has applications that enable us to see and prevent dangers from getting out of hand. It helps in boosting production, improving the use of sustainable materials, and investment, thus improving the quality of life. Lastly, scientific inquiry helps us gain more insight into our species, planet, and universe, and our role in the cosmos. Science and Democracy Thomas Jefferson, known for his contributions to the formation of the United States, was also a passionate scientist who believed in education. His ideas on freedom of speech, skepticism, pragmatism, and objectivity are integral to both scientific inquiry and a functioning democracy. Both science and democracy depend on the diversity and free exchange of ideas, subject to critical scrutiny. In a democracy, the executive, legislative, and judicial powers are separated, allowing for constant error correction. Political leaders who fail to live up to their promises find themselves out of a job, just as flawed theories must be discarded in science. Oppressive tyrants have little interest in scientific research because they want to maintain their monopoly on power. The parallels between scientific inquiry and a functioning democracy demonstrate the importance of the diversity of ideas and critical scrutiny in ensuring constant improvement. The Spiritual Side of Science The world of science is as awe-inspiring as the world of the spirit. Science is full of phenomena that, even after being explained, still sound like magic to us. Science appreciates the magnificence of our universe, making it a deep source of spirituality, not a constraint on human imagination. 
contrary to popular belief, science does not stand in opposition to religion. Rather, the two can go hand in hand, as both seek to understand the miracle of existence. The Art of Critical Thinking the ability to think critically is one of the most significant skills you can cultivate. It is fundamental in every aspect of your life and can help you make informed decisions. To be an adept critical thinker, you need to learn how to develop a good hypothesis, check facts continually, and consider all alternative explanations to the phenomena. Additionally, it is essential to beware of mistaking correlation for causation. The use of these critical thinking tools can help you differentiate between valid ideas and pure nonsense. Education and Critical Thinking The book highlights how African-American slaves' literacy contributed to the abolition of slavery, empowering them to understand laws and politically organize themselves better. The quality of education has significantly declined in recent times, leading to poor test results in science, especially for American students. Encouraging natural curiosity in children to ask questions and conduct experiments is vital in developing critical thinking. The book emphasizes the importance of explaining concepts for better understanding and exploring questions. Critical thinking should continue well beyond school as it is beneficial at every stage of our lives. Supporting Science Through Government Grants and Media Awareness The importance of science and critical thinking and the misrepresentation of scientists in the media, requires more than just improving science education in schools. Governments must fund purely scientific research, and scientists should publicly advertise their projects to garner public support and secure the necessary funding. Media should produce more programs that focus on real science instead of pseudoscience and superstition. The author launched the show Cosmos to educate non-scientists about different scientific research and help eliminate the damaging stereotype of scientists. Failure to engage the public in scientific thinking will lead to missed opportunities. As a passionate advocate for skepticism and scientific inquiry, Sagan's The Demon Haunted World reminds us of the importance of fostering a scientifically literate society. From debunking myths and superstitions to promoting transparent, ethical scientific research, the book enforces the need for a critical, questioning mindset in all aspects of life. Scientific curiosity, when paired with rigorous experimentation and a healthy dose of skepticism, not only illuminates our understanding of the universe but also has the power to shape our society, foster innovation, and equip individuals with the tools needed to discern fact from fiction. Ultimately, embracing the tenets of scientific thinking leads to a more informed, rational, and progressive world.